Good morning, everyone. How is everyone doing this morning? Today is Wednesday, the 24th of June. Uh, right now, I'm back home after all the, the traveling over the last few episodes. And uh, yeah, we've got lots to do today, so let's just get on with it. This morning, the first thing I have to do, um, not very exciting for you guys, is I've got a couple of uh, lessons to give. So I just need to get myself set up here, do a couple of lessons, and then I need to head out later on into uh, the Fred, Frederick land, which is a kind of, it's in the international area of the Hague, and it's one of the, probably one of the prettiest streets here. We'll take you there. I need to go get some cardboard boxes because um, the ones I ordered to send my vinyl have still not come. And now it's saying on the, the, the website for Post NL that they're not going to come till tomorrow. And uh, I'm starting to feel really bad because I still haven't sent these vinyls, which I was supposed to send on Monday. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go and see if there's something I can do to get this sorted out today. I feel like that's really important. Um, later on, I'm hoping to do um, some composing. Um, so on Monday, on the last episode, uh, I went to Rotterdam. And um, you saw a little clip of me playing with Sun, uh, playing the Eru and guitar and um, she's coming next week to record and um the ending of the song isn't right that much was made very clear i think the rest of the song is sounding great but the ending needs a little bit of work and um, just to make it sound a little bit more completed so i want to work on that today and perhaps finally get a chance to use my new akg mic so i might redo the acoustic guitars with a different ending and then add a different melody to it um so that's the plans that's the things i really want to get on with today Cool, so my lessons are just finished up for this morning. Um, right, the last lesson I just did, what I, what I need to do is I need to send my student a new song. So we're gonna start a new song soon. So um, this is an online student of mine. So basically what I do, I've got all my music, again, stored on Google Drive. Lesson notes for guitar, and then you can see here, I've got a whole selection of songs that I've kind of written out and stuff like that. And we're going to do some Oasis, um, I think, next. Let's have a wee look what we've done. We did, we did uh, the Rolling Stones, I Can't Get No Satisfaction. So she's um, a guitarist that's just kind of starting out. Um, and we're just taking some kind of simple rock songs and acoustic songs. And we're just trying to, uh, you know, get her to have a, a solid foundation of, of rhythm. Um, so we're just doing like mainly rhythm guitar and little bits of lead guitar as well, starting to uh, for to understand how that works. So yeah, I'm going to uh, finish doing this and then I need to get going and see if I can find these boxes for the vinyl before lunchtime. All right then, let's get going down to Pagland store. Oh yeah, got here. Look, these are the all the vinyls ready to be bought, sold, whatever. So I'm getting lots of uh, memories walking up uh, this way just now. Uh, when I first moved to The Hague, I lived on the street that's just around the corner here, uh, Nikolaistrat. Um, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna pass it in a moment. And uh, yeah, we had a rented place there um, for the first couple of years. And we just recently moved into the place that I'm living in now. Here it is, this is where I used to live, Nikolaistrat. Uh, yeah, funny, I'm gonna walk through it, why not? That's where I used to stay. Yeah, we're now at the bottom of Frederick Hendrickland. It's one of the, I would say, one of the nicest streets of the Hague. It's very pretty anyway. What I'll do is I'll, I'll film the street as I walk up and I'll kind of speed it up and you guys can see a little bit of the area that I'm in today. This square here is Frederick Henrik Plein. It's got a beautiful park in it and these, these, these beautiful houses. But it's a really nice spot, isn't it? Lots of nice places to sit outside and eat. here for uh, my like cuts of meat for sandwiches I 
if you're at home and you're watching this with someone else, you can place your bets now. Do you think I will be able to get the boxes that I require to send my vinyl? Or do you think I'm going to still be running about trying to find them in other places? I really want to get them today. Uh, and then the other ones I've ordered, when they come, I'll use them anyway. Uh, ah, I really hope I do. Right, okay. Place your bets now. Let's see what happens. And then we go. Pac-Man. So, did you take your bets? I failed. But they don't have them. <laughs> well, they don't have, they've got lots of boxes, but nothing that actually fits uh, what I'm looking for, which is a bit rubbish. But I got uh, given an address that she thinks will have everything because it's a, it's a company that sells to companies uh, who wrap their um, products. <laughs> I need to now get home, grab lunch with my wife, and then let's see if we can um, try this place and see what happens. I'm going to give them a call first before I go down there. So we've had a bit of success. Uh, I just spoke with the, the company that the, the lady from the shop advised me to, to contact and they have two boxes of vinyl packaging available. So if I pick up those two, I say two boxes, two boxes of 20, which is perfect because I have about uh, 30 odd vinyls to send. So it, it, it worked out really good. Um, I'm going to go home, grab lunch, if I can get across this road, and then uh, we're going to go search some vinyls. I don't know how much work we're going to get done uh, with recording today with uh, all this running about. Hopefully still some later tonight or something like that. But um, yeah, I'll take you guys on my adventure all the same. All right, let's go. Now, I'm a firm believer of living each day like uh, what would your 10 year old self think was cool? What would you do? Don't try and be too grown up and remember to have fun. And that is why I'm just about to walk over this park and I just know there's this little trampoline here. This is going to seem really silly, but I just love to jump on it just for a second. Let's go. <laughs> That's really fun. Okay. Que rico, chile pasilla con huevos y arroz. Guys, it's so warm today. It's crazy. Apparently going to get close to 30 degrees today. For a Scotsman, that's pretty extreme. So, uh, I've had lunch that was really good. And now I'm on my way to pick up these boxes. Um, yeah, I thought it was going to be, you know, an hour's walk and I was planning to walk. And then I looked and it's a two hour walk from my house to this, this place. So I'm going to have to take public transport. So we're going to jump on the... Ah! So we're going to jump on the tram. But what do I need? I need a mask. Okay, I'll be back soon. So we got a mask. What do you think? I like it, it's got music notes on it. <laughs> so attempt number two, boxes, here we come. Ready for the tram. <laughs> was a seriously long journey like <laughs> crazy so I don't know I have a clue where I am I'm uh, in the middle of nowhere it seems uh, quite far outside of the Hague but it's still within the metro and um, so let's see if we can go find this factory it's about 10 minutes walk I think from here da, 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 da. here we are Pard Culper Pard is a horse and Culper is is like a buyer so horse buyer Culper is a wait, like a um, yeah, like, like, well, basically what it's for, this company is they sell cardboard and packaging in general for um, people uh, who have their own businesses. So we're in the middle of nowhere, right on the very, very, I think the edge of what is actually the Hague. And uh, I'm going to now pop into the factory and see if I can uh, get this uh, sorted out. 
<laughs> well, that was interesting. Some pretty random people, and they were quite funny. Uh, they were asking me all about Scotland and how do you say cheers, and I was telling them about Slangevar and, and how do you say goodbye in Scotland, and I was getting all these uh, quizzes about being Scottish, which was quite amusing. But I managed to get boxes. They're bigger than I expected to carry. Um, so it's going to be a bit of a mission back. See the things I do for, for the people who buy my music. What, what, what a legend, right? Oh, I'm just like, okay, I'm going to put the phone down and try and carry these boxes without breaking them. <laughs> Cheers. I know I've already said this, but it is so warm today, guys. And right here, just waiting for the tram in the baking heat. I'm <laughs> absolutely melting. Here's my boxes. As you can see, they're quite big. They take up almost a whole chair there. It's quite a mission I'm on. Whew. I just had to run to a different bus because the tram I got was the wrong one. <laughs> so I made it home. Oh, that was crazy mission. Yeah. Right, okay, so you, you flip it back mm -hmm. and then towards me and then that goes there and then the vinyl goes in and then there's no way it can come out. So. Okay, we managed to get a few of the, um, the the deliveries paid for. I'm now printing the label, so you do this at home now. So at this point, I've got one vinyl completely ready to go. Um, I've got a whole bunch of things to get ready with the other ones. It's just, they're just not ready yet. Uh, but the place closes in 15 minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and at least post one today so the first one is sent out. And then tomorrow morning, first thing, I'll send everyone else's out and you'll all get them soon. First package has been sent off. That one went off to Mexico with a couple of vinyls in it. So finally, I managed to post something today. Oh my God, what a mission it has been. Right, now, I just found out that the store is actually open an extra hour than I, later than I expected. So. I perhaps still have time to make a few more vinyls up and also take them over. So I'm going to try and do that now. Now I've got tape as well. Uh, and let's see if I'm able to, to send a few more today. We've managed to make a bit more progress. I've got a few more boxes ready to go. So we have made some progress, which, wow, today's been, it's taken up the whole day trying to get this on top of this. Um, but you've got to learn, you know, you've got to learn somehow. So, okay, I'm going to run to the, the shop and get these uh, last few vinyls. Uh, posted just now. And here's a little update. We ma I managed to get everything all packed up and ready to go. So I got a good bunch of vinyl sent off today and I've got everything ready that I'm going to send off tomorrow morning. So everyone who has ordered a vinyl will get theirs in the next few days or so. Uh, that's great. I'm really happy about that. I, I feel like the, the process is complete. People have ordered them and I've now got everything ready and they're going to be sent out. Um, I think I'll continue this video on to tomorrow. Um, I, I'll, there's, I didn't get nearly nearly close to everything done that I wanted to get done today. Um, so um, yeah, I'll work on a bit of music tomorrow and I'll bring you guys with me. And uh, yeah, so. All right, folks, so it's the next day. We're now on a Tuesday, no, what day is this? We're now on Thursday morning. And uh, oh yeah, I was just, well, what I was just doing just now, I was out in the balcony in the sun and it was all nice and quiet and I was working on um, <laughs> an ending for Strange Days. What I realised on Monday was that the the ending was really not great that I had put together. So um, I'm trying to work on a better ending so that on Monday coming, when we go to record the tune properly, um, it will all be totally ready. Um, so yeah, the song kind of what it goes like, um has this kind of <laughs> And then, uh, so, I was just doing something like this, which is okay, but I was thinking something... Something like that, not exactly. I need to work on it a little bit. But anyway, I've got an idea there. So, um, yeah, I'll do it one more time. 
Is something like that. That was better, yeah. Um, and I'm imagining the Eru following it. The, the, sorry, Eru. Uh, I don't know, really high. I, I want it to go way up. Some way up there somewhere. So anyway, these ideas are cool. I'm, I've now got them running through my head. So now that I've got those running through my head, I don't have to work on it too much. It's better to actually put the guitar down. I'm now going to send the last of the vinyls that have been already ordered. A couple of people ordered through the night last night, so I got those ready this morning too. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for ordering everyone. Again, you're making my dreams come true, honestly. I appreciate it so immensely much. Um, for the very last time, in case you're wondering what I'm talking about, what it is, is I have a new vinyl, looking for a place called home. A uh, bunch of songs on it. It's a solo album, fingerstyle guitar. Um, I would say the best production that I've ever managed to create myself. It was not a cheap product to make. I'm really proud of it. It's it's uh, it, it's it's great, um, and I'm really looking forward to getting feedback from everyone once you get it. But what I'm going to do for one last time, I promise I won't advertise very often in this vlog or anything. But I will put the link in the description of this video. So if anyone else would like to get a copy you're more than welcome i've got a fair few of them left still and you can always just send me a message if you would like me to sign it i'll be happy to do that no bother at all okay now let's go and send those and then we're going to get back and we're going to get to work yes finally i've managed to do it wow i was hoping to get that done yesterday morning it seems like a whole mission i've been on to actually get those away but there we go finally done it there's a tramp so i'm really happy about that uh, right now I need to just pick up a little bit of food for lunch. I'm not sure what I'm going to get yet, actually. Some Something nice from the bakery, maybe, or something like that. And then, uh, yeah, I want to get back and work on that song um, for the rest of the morning before my afternoon gets really crazy busy. chords just now that I want to go underneath with the acoustic guitar to, for the harmony for the, the outro. So we've got a kind of ending, and then I need to kind of neaten it up, don't I? Um, right, what am I going to do? I think I need to now record again acoustic guitars. And this could be an opportunity to finally get to use my new AKG mic. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to just get that set up and try that out next. Okay, that's the plan. Okay, we're setting up the AKG now. It's been the strangest thing, just when I was trying to use my new microphone, my, my computer was making this kind of beep, 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 now, the noise like it was struggling. Um, and it seemed like um, when I was trying to uh, record also, um, it was like the, the CPU, um, the, the power of the Mac was like maxing out. And it's a brand new Mac and it's a, um, meant to be the top one for um, CPU power and things like that. So I was quite surprised at that. And then I thought, well, maybe it's the new microphone for some reason that's affecting it. So I tried the old microphone uh, that I used to have, and it's doing the same thing. Every time I switch on the condenser microphone, it's like the Mac can't cope, and it just doesn't allow me to record. Um, so the simplest option is to try and update. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm trying to update my Mac to see if that's going to fix the problem. So this is a, a longer update than expected. So, further update where we are just now. I've been fighting all afternoon with the computer. Um, at least I managed to get the music idea down, um, but my computer's been going kind of slow and, and, and just crashing and things. 
So my wife thought it looked like some kind of virus and they realized that I hadn't, uh, when I bought this just a few months ago, I hadn't installed any antivirus. So now that's what I have done. So hopefully that's gonna help to understand more what's going on with it. Up. I just had a really great lesson with one of my students, um, Tim, who's based over in Italy. Hi Tim, if you're watching by the way. Um, and you know, I was, I was feeling a little bit down, a little bit frustrated from uh, today. Um, and it's been a little bit of a, I don't know, a weird week. I mean, it's not been a bad week, it's just things haven't quite gone my way so, so much. Um, and um, yeah, just like fighting with my computer all day, trying to work it out. Uh, but then they're just you now just jumping online and then doing a lesson with a, an enthusiastic pupil was great. I really enjoyed it, so it was a lot of fun. Uh, I've got one more student coming now uh, before um, finishing up my lessons for today. I also was just trying to quickly upload some of the videos onto my computer to edit together um, this episode. And it told me there was no space on the disc to do that. So I'm thinking that that might have a lot to do with what the problem is with my computer. So I'm going to speak to later on with my wife who knows more about these things than me and see if I can uh, work, out, work out what that is. But I feel like I'm getting closer to understanding the problem anyway. Cool, so yeah, last lesson of the day over. Uh, I'm in a better mood than I was earlier, I have to admit. I wasn't quite my usual cheery self. <laughs> I think I was getting very frustrated. Um, I have a few more ideas of what I can do to, to look at the computer. Um, and yeah, I think it'll be fine. But you know what, it's, look at that weather outside. Let me show you. It's just so glorious. So guys, as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all soon. Peace.